Circle of Blue is a nonprofit um, journalism uh, organization. It's comprised of journalists and scientists, essentially covering water news. And I tell people that, and sometimes they look at me and go, water news? Um, but actually, there's a lot of news in our world right now centered on water. Carl Ganter is the co-founder. He and his wife uh, co-founded Circle of Blue a few years ago. In 2002, I attended the Visual Edge workshop at the Pointer Institute. So we met there, and I vaguely remember a conversation where he said, oh, I have Muncie ties. And Carl said, you know, we would love to have Ball State interns. Circle of Blue is really growing, and I, we're starting to do with more with information graphics, and I know you guys have a good graphics program, so it would be really cool if we could hook up. The more we talked on the phone about this notion of, of sending students to, to Circle of Blue, the more I got to thinking, like, Ball State's immersive learning um, initiative really presents more opportunities for us than just interns. And immediately, you know, he said, oh my gosh, this fall we have this Choke Point US package. We've been doing all of these stories on the water and energy crisis in the United States, and there's tons of graphics opportunities. I came, you know, back and very quickly, the first week of school, put together a team of five students, and um, we just started taking assignments. Well, the graphics we produced, um, we had to do one on the tar sands in North Dakota. Um, one of the, the best graphics I think that we did this past year was the situation at Lake Mead and the Hoover Dam and how water levels are dropping due to environmental and industry concern, industrial concerns and how that's going to affect millions of um, electricity customers in the, in the southeast that they could be without power. I mean, it's a, when you think about it that way, it's like, wow, like, this is huge and no one's really talking about it. Within 10 days, 10 to 14 days of starting the project, we had four uh, interactive graphics published on the Circle of Blue site. They were presented at the Woodrow Wilson Center for Scholars. They were part of a presentation at the Clinton Global Initiative. And in that said, all information graphics you know, for this project were created by Ball State students. And so it was like, oh my gosh, thank God, I didn't say no. In, in the news industry, and in any, and especially in, in like journalism, nothing says more than real world practical experience. That's why students work in student media, you are more outside the classroom. And literally, I mean, this is a class outside the classroom.